wanted to test to see if the um, supercharger will be reachable with this on. So here you can see with this, um, the way it is, I'm actually parked really close to the line. If I'm not parked close to the line, I can actually back this thing all the way between the stalls, no problem, right? So that's actually nice. Let's actually open this up and whoop, and you can actually see the charger will reach, no problem. I don't wanna charge because it's gonna cost me money and right now it's peak time, so yeah. But I should be able to charge, no problem, as long as I'm not sticking things out over the side edges here. And then, um, yeah, it looks like I could probably do that at every single stall um, and it shouldn't be an issue. So yeah, these kinds of trailers work well. The only thing, again, keep in mind, the weight limit of this is 160 pounds that like downward force. And I don't know how that works because the further out this extends, the more leverage it has. So the more heavy stuff is over here, that's actually making it like a lot harder on the, the hitch over there. So keep that in mind. If you're putting like heavy stuff, heavier stuff, you probably want to have it closer up here. Don't put it as far back as possible. Um, so actually having those racks where it's like as close to the car as possible are probably better. Um, but that's how this one's designed. You actually have like a good probably foot and a half or so of space, I think. Yeah. So maybe a foot, foot and a half ish. Um, I haven't measured it, but around there. But yeah, as you can see, there's plenty of room for this thing to go over these. And uh, because I'm parked so close to the line, um, I can almost hit this, but you can actually see in your mirror um, that you're not gonna hit it. So technically you'd be perfectly fine. All right, so that's pretty much it. Hopefully this video helps some of you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.